Good evening guys, this is Sumail. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today in this video we'll be learning about how to make a barrel vaulted ceiling. These are some of the reference images of vaulted ceiling. You may come across such type of ceilings in any of your projects. So today we are going to see how to make this kind of ceilings easily in Dialogs Evo. So let's get started. Open the Dialogs. For now, I will, I will consider a room planning. Select length of the room. Let us, let me keep it as 10 meters for now. Width. Let's check the AutoCAD drawing. For this, I have considered a sample AutoCAD drawing of an elevation of the vaulted ceiling. I will show you this AutoCAD drawing in the description. It will be available to download for one week. If you want to practice making this vaulted ceiling, you can use this AutoCAD file okay so let's check the width from here to here it's two meters so width is two meters height height is 3.5 meters 3.5 wall thickness let it be 0.1 meters for now okay we have constructed a room we will draw a floor element select draw rectangular floor element and draw the floor okay we have constructed the room now let's make the vaulted ceiling let's go and study our autocad file this whole portion will consider to be a ceiling the distance of this ceiling from the floor level let's measure it it's 2.5 meters so we'll go to the ceilings make sure you are in story mode insert ceiling into the room distance from the shelf floor we just measure it is 2.5 meters okay and the story height is 3.5 meters then this thickness will be 1 meter so we will select the ceiling and make the ceiling thickness to be 1 meter okay save it now what you have to do is to proceed with the further steps for now let's just edit the ceiling polygon and make it little less okay. only for further steps again you can extend it okay we'll go to the room set the view like this now measure the height of this vaulted ceiling assume this is the normal from here to here the height is 0.97 meters so we'll go to the dialogues helplines and labeling draw reference grid place the point on the ceiling and extend it we need this help lines to properly make this sectional detail okay we have marked this reference line the height of this vaulted ceiling is 0.97 meters so we will give this distance as 0.97 meters done save it measure the width of this vaulted ceiling it is 1.94 meters okay remember that value this is very important steps select the cutout tool draw circular cutout okay here in number of segments you can increase the number of segments up to 60 for a smooth curvature but if you increase the number of segments your the poly size of the 3d model will increase which will impact on your calculations and the file size so keep the number of segments between 30 to 40 to get the smooth curvature if you have good specs system or a laptop you can go for higher number of segments for now i will keep it 40 okay and i will just randomly on this reference line which i have drawn i will draw a circle on it okay like this escape now what you need to do is select the circle give the dimension to it what we have measured 1.94 meters okay so we'll make it as 1.94 meters here too we'll make it as 1.94 meters enter now select this cutout tool okay and bring the top tip of the circle touch your reference line okay something like this so it is correct check 
check the ceiling say not as properly cut so this is your vaulted ceiling perfect you can extend it we will scale it like this look perfect you can switch off the reference line by clicking on this save it this is one of the simplest method of making a barrel vaulted ceiling there are other ways to do it too you can use the extrusion volume and trace the points trace by points all the surface and close the polygon scale it you will get the vaulted ceiling but it takes too much of time and concentration to place the points properly okay or you have other step too you can make use of cube and sphere subtracted scale it you will get a vaulted ceiling but i think this is the most efficient way because this is ceiling itself it's not any object or a extrusion volume so this is good as per the calculation too because you will get a correct clearance height details in the lux reports now let's just now let me just add some detail add some add some luminous and show you the effect of a vaulted ceiling when it is lighted up something like this this is done i have i placed some lighting and did a calculation and this is the effect after calculation the ceiling is proper vaulted ceiling you can easily adjust the arch shape by just scaling this one it is so simple see the arch shape is changed now okay so you need to you need to measure the height of this arch length and also its width so that you can properly make this roof so this is how you make a barrel vaulted ceiling in the dialux evo easy steps make use of ceiling and cutout tools and you can easily edit it without putting too much efforts on points so this is it guys in this video if you like this video please hit a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and stay tuned to explore more in dialogues with me